How's it going, guys? In today's video, I'm going to break down the Giants and Rangers swapping struggling outfielders, including Willie Calhoun, who is the centerpiece of the trade for you, Darvish, being traded to the Giants in exchange for outfielder Steven Duggar. The two big takeaways from this trade is that one, this is a good change of scenery trade for Calhoun and Duggar, given that they both are ranked pretty highly as prospects, and they have a decent amount of potential, but they have failed to capitalize on said potential. Secondly, this gives the Giants some potential depth given that stud outfielder Luis Gonzalez was placed on the injured list the same day as the trade. In Calhoun, the Giants are getting an outfielder who has a lot of power potential, but one who has failed to capitalize on said potential. Calhoun was a very highly ranked prospect in the Dodgers system and was even the centerpiece of the U Darvish trade. He made the major soon after the trade, and he hit okay between 2017 and 2018 before breaking out in 2019, hitting 21 homers in only 83 games and had a 270 batting average. Unfortunately for Calhoun, it has been downhill since then as he has struggled to hit for power or to make contact in the bigs. This season, he has hit only 136 with one home run, albeit in 18 games, but he has still struggled in the minors as well. Given that Calhoun is only a designated hitter, his offense will have to heat up by a lot for him to, to prove any value, but maybe the Giants see something in him, and it wouldn't be the first time they've turned a reclamation project into a stud. In return for Calhoun, the Giants are getting Steven Duggar, a 28-year-old outfielder. Duggar made his big league debut in 2018, and he had a pretty solid rookie season, being worth one win above replacement level. While his offensive production was pretty darn bad in 2019 and 2020, he rebounded last season hitting 257 with 8 home runs and had a 106 OPS+, plus, helping to contribute to a 2.2 wins above replacement. But while his hitting numbers are modest, Duggar is really good defensively and thus has a decently high ceiling and could be a solid 4th or 5th outfielder for the Rangers. But the big question is whether Duggar can hit as he has hit in the majors or in AAA this year. Overall, this is a solid, albeit a low-risk trade for both teams. It's a change of scenery trade that while it is usually fairly minor, every once in a while, one of these change of scenery candidates pops off and makes the team that acquired him look like a genius. Calhoun has a chance to do it, but he also has an extremely low floor. Duggar probably won't ever hit enough to be a big league regular, but he also has a high enough ceiling to be a 4 for 5th outfielder. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and tell me what you think of this trade in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.